I'm sure we've all been there, hours spent adjusting layouts, tweaking designs and trying to make everything fit just right. The frustration builds, the clock ticks and it feels like you're just chasing your tail. Ah, forget about this old way of doing things, let me introduce you to Gamma.app, your AI powered design partner ready to transform your ideas into stunning presentations, websites and more all in just seconds. Now you can create these with AI from a one line prompt in just a few seconds. Generate the outline, pick a theme and voila, your very own beautiful and professional presentation is ready. Need to tweak your content? No problem. With Gamma.app, restyling is effortless. One click and your entire design transforms into something fresh and dynamic. And when you're ready to share, Gamma's dynamic content works flawlessly across any device, keeping your audience engaged no matter where they are. Okay guys, so let me show you how easily you can create a beautiful presentation in just a few seconds using Gamma.app. Yeah, by the way, it's gamma.app, not gamma.ai. But as always, I'll leave all the links in the description below. Okay, let me show you now. Okay, so welcome to your gamma.app dashboard. So as you can see, I have the plus plan here, and I believe it's just only $8 per month. So very, very inexpensive indeed. So from here, as you can see, you can start creating immediately. And for this, all you have to do is click on this big button here, create new AI. There you go. And right here, we have three different options. So you can paste in text. So if you have existing notes, maybe an outline or existing content, you can copy and paste it here. You can generate with a one line prompt, or you can also import a file or URL. So this is going to help you to enhance existing documents, presentations, or web pages. So in our case here, let's go ahead with the one liner. Let's continue with this. And then you need to select what type of content you want to generate. Is it a presentation? Is it a web page? Or is it a document? So in our case, maybe you're going to go with presentation as well. Okay. And then you have to select the amount of cards that you want to display. So I'm going to go maybe with seven cards. Okay, select your language and then enter your prompt. So in our case here, we're going to go with the official launch of a new YouTube channel called Wacky Fishing. And we're going to create the outline. And there you go, guys. We have our seven cards here. And card number one is Wacky Fishing, our new YouTube channel, which, by the way, is a new channel we just launched last week. So if you're into fishing, go and have a look. And then we have introduction to Wacky Fishing, unique fishing techniques, outrageous fishing challenges and adventures, and so on and so on. Now, if you'd want to remove any of them, simply hover on top here and then delete the card. And then you can move them around as well, reorganize them. So perhaps you want this one to be the penultimate. Well, you can put it here and that's basically it, okay? So you can add cards manually if you wanted to as well afterwards. So you can do that manually and add your own chapter or delete it all together, okay? And then after this, we have our settings here so first the amount of text per card is it brief medium or detailed you know what let's go with detailed for this one and then the image source we have three different options here but i'm going to select ai images for now because we can set our image style as well and for this i'm going to set it to this okay so use irish lakes as background the style should be realistic and mood as intrigue okay and here you can search your image model. So you have Imagine 3, Playground 2.5, Flux, and so on and so on. So this is really up to you, you know. Now DAL E3, so this is basically ChatGPT. This one is part of the Pro version, but by default, I'm just going to use this one, okay? So let's go with Image 3, and then let's continue. Very good, and now we have to select our theme. So as you can see, you can select Dark Mode, Light Mode, professional looking or colorful so in our case here i suppose wacky fishing is a bit uh, out there you know it's uh, something a bit uh, uh, playful and all that so i'm just gonna go maybe with this one here okay why not and then after that all you have to do is to click generate excellent so that's done already so that took maybe 10 seconds max including pictures and also very very fast indeed so right here on top as you can see get ready to reel in some wacky fun so this is a good headline to be honest you know Welcome to Wacky Fishing, your new destination for all things quirky and creative in the world of fishing. And funny enough, this is exactly what the channel is all about. So remember we said, uh, make sure you have an Irish leg in the background. So this is what has been done here. This is very realistic, you know, this is a beautiful picture, by the way. And then you have meet the crew, the Wacky Fishing techniques, uh, connect to our community. Uh, get ready for some outrageous fishing challenges and a lovely image here as well, you know. 
and maybe a few steps and so on and so on. So I think that looks very, very professional indeed. Very good. Now, as you go through the content here, maybe there are a few things that you'd like to change. You can do so manually or you can ask AI to improve on it or change it all together. So as you can see right here, you have a, a card styling, you have edit with AI and those button here is to move it for, from one place to the other. Okay, so you can drag it up or down the page as well. So card styling, if you click on this, as you can see, you have the accent image, the card color, a bleed card, white content and backdrops. So this is to allow you to customize this manually or maybe you want to ask AI edit with AI. So you could ask things, for instance, like improve writing, fix spelling and grammar, translate, make it longer, make it shorter, simplify the language, be more specific. And then obviously you can type it manually as well. Type your own prompt if you wanted something specific that's not included here. So in our case, let's try to make this more visual. Okay, see what happens if you click on this. Okay, let's click on this together. And as you can see, it's working on it. Wow, we have the background here being created as well. And there you go, guys. As you can see, that looks absolutely amazing, doesn't it? Get ready to reel in some wacky fun. So the, the content remains the same, but it added more images, obviously, to make it more visual. So we have achieved this. So I'm going to say done with edit. I'm happy with this. And let's move on to the next one. And again, here you can customize exactly everything the way you want. So again, you can do this manually using your card here or use AI to do it for you. Okay, so let's try another one here. Maybe try a different layout. Very good. So as you can see, that's not too bad at all. So let's try maybe another layout again, just to see what it's going to come up with. Excellent. As you can see, we get a new layout each and every time. And if you're happy with it, well, let's click on this or you can go back to the original. So let's agree with this. Perfect. And then you can do so obviously with all your sections. Now, let's say you wanted to add a section afterwards. All you have to do is to hover on this and you can add a card using AI or you can do that from a template. So as you can see, a blank card, uh, image and text, text and image, two columns, and so on and so on. So this is if you wanted to do it manually. But obviously here, the beauty of the system is AI. So let's click on this button instead. And again, right here, you can type your prompt. So let's say our first episode, I go fishing with a spoon from the kitchen. Second video, I make my own waders out of bin bags. And the third video, I go lake fishing with the sea rig. Will it work? You know, so basically we're going to create this based on that. And we're not going to select any template. Uh, let's surprise us. Okay, let Gamma decide. So let's uh, publish this. And as you can see, it created this as a timeline, which is actually really clever. Spoon fishing, DIY waders, and lake fishing with the sea rig. Now, again, like we've discovered early on, if you wanted to change this, maybe to make it more visual or try a different layout, they can do so immediately, you know? So let's try it to make it more visual and see what will happen. And there you have it. Now, I'm going to be honest with you, I am blown away by the quality of those images. You can see a fisherman using a spoon. These are actual DIY waders, and this is lake fishing with a sea fishing rig, and this could absolutely be it. And we have the background, like we said, an Irish lake. This is what we requested. So this is absolutely amazing, guys, okay? So if you're happy, done editing, and that's basically it. So by the side, you have your menu section here. As you can see, card templates, if you want to add a new card. You have your smart layout, the basic blocks, images, video and media, embedded apps and web pages, uh, chart and diagrams, and also forms and buttons. So with this, you can basically insert whatever you want and create everything exactly the way you picture it in your mind. And you can do so manually as well or using AI like we just did, okay? So these are all the tools that you can use to create everything manually. And then you have your theme as well. So initially, as you can see, we selected a blue background. Maybe you want to try something different, maybe something bolder. All you have to do is to go back here and as you can see, you can select another one, you know, and it will be applied uh, throughout the whole presentation here. So I'm going to go with something a bit more uh, colorful, maybe this one, Aurora, see what happens. And uh, I think that looks actually not too bad at all, does it? Uh, so we can go ahead with this. So if you're happy enough with what you have, you can have a quick preview as well. So right here, I have a present. Uh, use the drop down uh, arrow. You have the present of you in this tab or full screen. So let's go full screen for a few seconds here. Okay, just to show you what it looks like. Excellent. So it will show you the slide on which you were at the moment. So if I use the up and down arrow, it will go back to the top of the presentation. So I think this looks absolutely gorgeous. Let's say if you had investors in the room and you having a presentation and all that, trying to, to get financing or something in place, I think they'll be delighted enough with the result because to be honest, this looks really, really, really professional indeed. And all of that, guys, has been done in just a few minutes. So I'm going to hit the escape key now and go back to our slides. 
And then once you're happy enough with everything and you want to share that maybe via email or show that maybe to your boss or something like this, all you have to do is to click on this button here and share a follow link. Okay, click on that. So this is your link. I'm going to copy this and I'm going to show you what it looks like in a new window. So for this, I'm going to open it in a different browser. And this is exactly the view and the preview that someone would have if they were to follow that link. So as you can see, I have the introduction here, second slide, third slide. And as you can see, that looks absolutely amazing. I know I keep saying that, guys, but I'm absolutely blown away by this solution. You know, this looks really, really professional indeed. And whomever is going to open this using your link has also the present button here. So if they click on this, as you can see, you have on top here, you have the auto zoom in and zoom out. So we have it at 200%, which is fine. And you also have the spotlight mode. So if I click on this, as you can see, we will emphasize step one and then step two and then step three and all the different points one and two here are now faded away a little bit you know so you have full focus on the different steps and i think this is a very nice touch as well you know so let's x out of this and this is basically how this works guys you can share this with anyone and they'll have access to your full presentation now let's build a website for let's say maybe a graphic designer okay so let's do that together now okay very good so let's create with ai so we're gonna use the one line prompt again this time so continue this is a web page let's go with a bit less cars maybe four in total and let's enter our prompt so this is for a website for a freelance graphic designer based in dublin ireland include a portfolio section that's basically it okay so generate the outline excellent so i'm going to replace your name here so i'm going to put john doe Excellent. And then section one. So this is us, portfolio, services, and contact. So I think maybe we're going to move this around, have services first, then the portfolio, and then the contact. Okay. We're going to leave it as is. Medium is fine. AI images and keep the same model. And uh, let's continue. Very good. So now we can select our theme. So I think this one looks good already. So let's try different colors. Maybe this one here, this one there. Uh, I think this one is actually not, not bad at all, you know. So let's go with this one, okay? So generate. And there you go. As you can see, it's creating everything for us. So this shouldn't take more than a few seconds anyways. So I can hide this one for now. So as you can see, this is done already. It took only a few seconds. Let's wait for those images to show up now. And there you have it. As you can see, John Doe, freelance graphic designer in Dublin. And here we have the Happening Bridge, which is a famous bridge in Dublin city center. And we have here the services, we have a portfolio, very, very nice indeed. And the contact page. Now, as you can see, again, this has been created for us in just a few seconds. Feel free to customize your menu section here and add call to action buttons. Now, the only difference with this compared to presentation is that you can publish immediately. Okay, so I'll click on publish. Excellent. And now you can view your site. And there you have it, guys. This is our landing page for uh, John Doe, freelance graphic designer in Dublin. Uh, background image, our services, and so on and so on. And again, as you can see, this is our own landing page. So that means that you can share that URL with anyone you want. So this is very, very handy indeed. Now, obviously, again, uh, we're not going to go through this. Uh, we just covered that in the previous presentation, but you can customize everything here, obviously, manually as you see fit. Excellent. And finally, let's try to improve an existing document. So we're going to start with a very rough PDF file that contains only text. Okay. Let's do that together. So this is the document we're going to use. Uh, ask ChatGPT to create a full article related to Gamma.app. So this is what we have, guys. Okay, as you can see, we have a main heading, a subtitle, sub subtitle, and a few pointers here. So this is nicely laid out, but obviously it's not as interesting as it looks. It's just bare text. So let's put this to the test. Okay, so we go to Gamma again, import file or URL. So this is what we're going to do. Upload file. So this is the file. Okay, so open. Okay, so this has been uploaded and now we're going to turn this into a document. As you can see, this is the one here. Okay, we haven't tried this yet. So let's click continue and see how Gamma.ai can improve our PDF file. So continue. Very good. So this is exactly the content of our PDF file. So this has been imported already. And right here, you have a few different options. Okay, so we're going to leave it by default and test it out as it is. So continue. Select your theme. So again, let's go for something a bit fancy so professional maybe and let's go with Aurum excellent so let's generate and there you go this is done now so as you can see we have the exact same content as we had from our PDF file 
but put in a lovely, more presentable manner, obviously, you know, as you can see, responsive design and user experience. How Gamma can grow your business, productivity and professionalism. So you have title, subtitle, and then it's broken down very nicely. So basically, this is the exact same structure we have here, but so much more easier to digest. So if you wanted to approach investors, maybe, or something like this, you're looking for funding, obviously this type of presentation is much better it will obviously increase your chances of cracking a deal rather than sharing a bare pdf file like this one so there you have it guys an amazing tool that can help you design truly professional presentations in just a few seconds as always i'll leave all the links in the description below thanks for watching and i'll catch you in the next one